the chance of getting into Google is less than 1%. You need to be super prepared and get ready for the product manager interview questions at Google. In this video, I'm going to share with you the Google Product Manager Interview Questions database and what framework you need to use to answer these questions. Hey guys, this is Dr. Nancy Lee, a director of product from drnancylee.com. I help people transition from worker bee to product manager and business leader. If you want to learn the most effective way to become a product manager, you should subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell button so be notified every time I turn on a new video every Wednesday. Recently, a student I got an offer from Google and several other students also preparing for the Google PM product manager interviews. They all use my Google product manager interview questions database and the framework to nail that offer. Disclaimer, all those questions I'm going to share with you came from public internet and from anonymous resources for them to contribute to the public internet. I just summarized all the available information for you guys so that you can get ready for the Google interview more efficiently. Now let's get started. In my last video, I talked about five different kinds of interview questions in Google and how to prepare them so that you can nail the Google interview. If you haven't watched the video, just must watch video before you watch this in-depth video. Now let's talk about what kind of interview questions would you expect if you interview at Google. The first type of question is about what's your favorite product? That's very typical, not just Google, for any other company they will ask you this question. There are some simple questions they will ask regarding your favorite product. For example, question number one, what's your favorite non-Google product, how to improve it? What's your favorite non-digital product, how to improve it? And how to include Google Maps? I filmed a separate video teaching you how to answer these kind of questions, what's your favorite product and how to improve it. If you want to see my sample answer, you should check out this video right here about me answering the question, what's my favorite crypto product? The typical mistakes for people who answer this question but fail the interview is that they jump into the features directly without talking about the customer segmentations and also customer pain points. And this is just one of the 10 mistakes people always make and make them lose their offer. I'm going to make a detailed video about what are the top 10 mistakes people are making when you interview at those kind of top fan companies. Feel free to subscribe to the channel and you will be notified when I upload this new video in the near future. Besides what's your favorite product type of questions, Google also will ask you product design or product sense interview questions. Let me give you some examples. Question number four, design a product for people moving to a new city. Question number five, design a driverless car service to pick up kids from kindergarten. Question number six, how do you design a playlist for users user after they listen to a single song? They also have interview questions regarding the hot topics nowadays, such as design a solution to combat climate change. You should also get ready for them to ask you any questions about non-physical product. For example, design a bicycle. Sometimes they'll also ask you to design their competitor's products, such as question number nine, how would you improve Facebook Marketplace? The framework to answer these type of product design interview questions is the modified circles framework. I have enhanced the traditional circles framework to get an A plus answer. You can check out my modified circles framework right here in this video where I give you a sample example, how would you design an Uber app for people with disabilities? A very important reminder, in order for you guys to get a good start when you answer any of those interview questions, you need to ask several clarifying questions so that you wouldn't go to the wrong path. I have a specific cheat sheet where you can use the 10 clarifying questions you need to ask at Product Sense interviews. I'm going to link the cheat sheet down below in this video. And on top of that, Google will also like to challenge you because it's very hard to get into Google. They will ask you questions like this. Question number 10, design a music app for deaf people. So it's very challenging, so think about how would you apply the similar kind of framework I told you earlier to the specific interview questions. All of these are very interesting product design interview questions. I recommend all of you guys to use the right framework to practice at least 20 different kind of cases with the right type of people so that you will get ready to the next level. I have a webinar coming up teaching people how I got four product managed jobs within 60 days without applying online. Also use the same methodology helped over 100 product managers to get their dream offer as well. I'm going to link the free webinar in the description of this video. Make sure you check it out. Besides those product design, product sense, and what's your favorite product type of interview questions, Google will also ask you product strategy type of question. They are different from the consulting strategy questions. So I want you guys to use the right methodology to solve these challenges. 
So let me give you some examples. What are the product strategy questions? Question number 11, should Lyft enter the food delivery service? Question number 12, why do you think Facebook launched the Facebook portal product? Question number 13, how would you get more usage for Google search? If you are in my product manager accelerator, you should use the framework we teach in the class, such as the sales funnel framework and also the price framework to answer these kind of questions. If you are not in my PM Accelerator program, and don't worry, I'm going to make new videos teaching you how exactly you can answer this kind of product strategy question. Make sure to subscribe to the channel so you'll be notified when I upload this new video coming up very quickly. Google will also ask you some estimation type of questions. In my personal opinion, this is the easiest type of interview questions at Google. Now let me give you some examples. Question number 14. How much storage do you need for a photo storage device? Question number 15. Pick your favorite city. How long will it take to get a Google Street View of the entire city? Question number 16, which is my favorite question. How much storage does YouTube need for the next year? As a big YouTuber, I want to know this answer as well. Let me comment down below and let me know what do you think the right answer is. I think the estimation question is relatively easy, so I already told you guys the framework in this video. I'm going to link the video in the description of this current video so that you can check out this framework. Google will also definitely ask you those kind of technical interview questions if you move to the final round of Google. So let's get ready for the technical interview questions. Question number 17, create a scalable system that create unique IDs. Question 18, design a system to store large videos. Question number 19, design a URL shortener. Question number 20, how does a Gmail inbox work? These kind of questions will be very, very challenging for you to solve if you don't have an engineering background. So I recommend all of you guys to check out some fundamental software architecture classes and also the MIT system design methodology. I have selected a list of software engineering classes and free YouTube videos. You can see them in the description of this video. Getting a PM job at Google is one of the hardest things. I want you guys to get ready and fully prepared and use the best strategy. So I recommend all of you guys check out my free webinar coming up where I teach you how I got full product manager job within 60 days without applying jobs online. And so that you will learn the latest strategy and help you to get an offer very quickly. If you like any of the content I share with you today, please like and subscribe to the channel and share this with anybody who is preparing for Google product manager interview. This is Dr. Nancy. I'm going to see you next time. Bye.